Good afternoon. I'm going to present our paper entitled EEG-based VCI emotion recognition using this talk, the emotion data set. The authors are myself, Edgar P. Torres, Edgar A. Torres, Miriam Hernandez Alvarez, and Sang Gun Yu. This presentation is composed of the following parts. Introduction with a brief vision of emotion, elicitation methods, and stock trading related emotions. That assists construction to obtain emotions represented in a balanced arousal space. EEG channel used to record the brain's participants' electroencephalographic signals, emotion recognition system with an explanation of its components, discussion, and conclusion. Emotions are eff affective states that influence our behavior. They play an essential role in decision making and managing them is related to emotional intelligence. In passive methods, the participants are observers of different stimuli to provoke emotions. For instance, recalling past experiences that cause feelings, watching music videos and film clips, listening to music, viewing images or dyadic interactions. Interactive procedures can be uh, applied to provoke emotions. Examples of these procedures may be video games, play simulators, and virtual reality immersion. These methods vary in their emotion generation reliability. Neither of these type of approaches are is similar to a real life situation or a work environment. We intend to recreate the situation in a specific environment where participants need to recognize their emotions and auto-regulate them to achieve optimal performance. For our experiments, this scenario will be trading in the stock market. Our research uses a novel type of situation or affected states proven to be effective at emotion provocation. Our proposed method is interactive and it recreates a real work environment that is highly competitive, stock trading. In this scenario, every decision has significant consequences of losses or winnings, and participants consistently feel strong emotion during, due to uh, the money component. With this approach, we obtained EEG signals associated with the three specific feelings related to stock trading, fear, hope and sorrow. We also had a baseline associated with the relaxation state because we asked the participants to relax and meditate in each experiment's first two minutes. According to several authors, these emotions, fear, hope and sorrow, are feelings that the traders must avoid. These emotions lead to decisions based on fear of missing out or panic selling and may cause traders to sell at market bottoms or buy market tops. The data set was constructed sensing the brain signals of eight healthy individuals, four males and four females, 25 to 60 years old. Before the experiment, the participants had one hour seminar regarding general trading principles, the trading platform, and how to interpret stock charts. Each participant learned the basics of trading, including a general thinking framework for making discretionary trading decisions. The trading experiment was simulated, that is to say, no real money was at risk. However, we used live market data. As a reference, Johnson and Bickel conducted experiments and concluded that the feelings toward real and hypothetical money were very similar in intensity. The figure shows the balance arousal space representing the three key emotions that influence trading activities and the relaxed state location. Since our test subjects had no prior experience with trading, simulated or otherwise, it is not surprising to see that none of them ever achieved the real ideal trading state of mind. We used a brain-computer interface VCI autocortex 
mark for EEG or headset to record the study of individuals EEG signal. It was equipped with eight channel dry electrodes to record brain signal. We used a Cytone biosensing board with an eight channel neural interface and a 32 bit processor to collect the EEG signal. The board communicates wirelessly with a computer with a USB dongle. We applied a, the 10 to 20 system diagram with the channel 1 to 8 of the OpenBCI default setting. In the figure, we show the system electro location. The components of the emotion recognition system are the following. Signal acquisition with a headset. Preprocessing to eliminate artifacts as blinking or heartbeat signals and noise from electrical sources. Feature extraction to capture the most relevant characteristics of the EEG signals. Classification using machine learning algorithms and performance evaluation with accuracy calculation. Preprocessing. The acquired EEG signal were preprocessed to eliminate body generator artifacts such as blinking, eye, and heartbeat. For this, we used two Butterworth IIR filters with zero phase to keep frequencies between 1 Hz and 40 Hz. Also, we eliminated electrical noise using a notch filter to delete 60 Hz frequency components. Feature structure. In the time domain, statistical based characteristics and high order crossing HOC were extracted. We selected essential features that contain the most relevant characteristics of the signal, that is, mean and variance. Classification. To cover a wide range of algorithm types, we used nearest neighbor neural networks and ensemble classifiers. KNN, MLP, and Random Forest were chosen because they had the best performance. We applied a 20 to 80 split for the test and training data sets, we obtained the parameter experimentally for the best performance for each algorithm. In the table, we can see accuracy results. For data sets, ours stock emotion and the public deep, we can see classifiers, algorithms used and accuracy obtained. Ours is a small data set composed of EEG signals from eight subjects with 12 emotion labeling. However, the classification results were satisfactory. For context, a random classification result would have been 33%, three available classification categories, and the KNN algorithm performed 40% better than that. MPL and random forest algorithms also had a 30% classification performance in excess over random classification. Thus, our results are consistent with algorithm capturing signals and not mere random noise. The presented results show that our elicitation method efficiently regenerates these three critical emotions related to stock trailer in competitive markets, as described before. As future work, we plan to extend our primary data set for further testing of emotion elicitation methods. Thanks for your attention. Gladly, I am going to answer any questions.